Welcome back. A lot of us lost power during Hurricane Irma, which means we had to throw out a lot of spoiled food. And as we cleaned out our refrigerator and began the process of restocking, I got to thinking of what I really should be keeping in there. And turns out I was missing a few things. So I found that interesting. Today's Lauren's List is all about these surprising things you should be refrigerating. First up, people are going to crucify me for this, red wine. Before you sound the alarm on this one, I'm not suggesting you drink red wine cold, although some people say a slight chill makes it taste better. Instead, experts say refrigerating an already open but unfinished bottle of red wine will help slow down the chemical processes, including oxidation, which will ruin the wine. So you can always let it come back to room temperature before drinking it. Again, of course, this all assumes people don't finish off an entire bottle in one sitting in the first place. Next up, tortillas. No one wants a rock hard quesadilla. Once you open the seal on a bag of soft taco wraps, be sure to put it in the refrigerator so they last a bit longer. Next up, olive oil. I know a lot of people who keep their olive oil in one of those nice glass bottles on their kitchen countertop, and that's actually too bright and too warm. Oxygen, light, and heat will make the oil turn bad faster, so keeping your olive oil in the fridge can help prolong its shelf life. And finally, nail polish. What? I keep my big box of nail polish in my bathroom, but I may change that now. It turns out nail polish will maintain its color and consistency longer in the refrigerator thanks to the cold air. The good news here is even if the power does go out, chances are your nail polish will still survive, so you won't have to throw that out like all the food that we lost in that storm. So what strange things do you keep in your refrigerator? Tell me on Facebook or Twitter, and if you have an idea for a future Lauren's List, send it my way too.